Hey guys, I'm Brad of Brave the Woods, and a few weeks ago I purchased an awesome, awesome sculpture made by Jeremy Spears of the Whittle Wood Shop. So Jeremy's an illustrator, and Whittle Wood Shop is his online store where he sells hand carved items, but then he hand casts them in resin and then hand paints them so they look like they were the original wood sculpture. And he does really small batches of these and they sell out very, very quickly because he's very talented. This time around, he did a bear and it's like a nine and a half inch tall bear that has so much character and has a little hat and everything. I'm really excited. I won't go too far into it because I'm going to open it up here with you. I know a lot of people tried to purchase it when it first went live on his site and didn't get to. And I was one of the lucky ones who did. I set a timer. My wife made fun of me, but I did it anyways. And uh, luckily I was able to get his little bear called Emmett. And uh, I'm going to show it to you right now. So hopefully as amazing as it looked on uh, online and uh, we'll go check it out. Okay, let's open this up and take a look. Should I be scared to uh, shove a knife in here? Or... Let's, let's see. Okay. Apparently not this one. It's not that sharp. Oh, there you go. There we go. Should have picked a sharper knife. It's a pretty sweet knife though. A little fish knife. <clears throat> oh man, there it is. The Whittle Bear. I've been waiting to get a carving or at least a resin casting of a carving that uh, Jeremy has made for a long time. He's done quite a few different animals and they always seem to sell out super fast. So I was really happy to get my, my hands on this one. So let's open this up. Let me move this aside actually. Lay here. Man, it's so cool. He already did some custom, you know, custom box. The illustration's neat. Yeah, he added this last second, the uh, the bandana, and I love it. Let's see if I can pull it out here. Let's move this aside for a second. Let's take one thing at a time. Enjoy the wilderness. See, that's what makes me mad is he's a good illustrator too. <laughs> he can do all these this carvings, and but he's an amazing illustrator as well. Dang, Jeremy, you outdid yourself. This is pretty sweet. And I wasn't planning on getting that. I was just paying for the uh, the bear. So that's an awesome bonus. Sweet little bandana. Okay, let's go back to the, the main attraction here. What's this? Oh, yes. Again, this is something that I did know before I bought it. But it just got me even more excited to buy it. Was this little hat? Oh, so what is that? Is that wood or is oh, oh it's supposed to be another resin cast as well? It's got the little oh, there we go. Let's pull that around. It's got his little ranger cap. Oh, got it, got it, got it. It goes underneath his. I see. There we go. It goes underneath his little neck right there. Okay, we'll figure that out. And then we got a little bandana here for the bear. So you guys can be, well, matching, both having bandanas, that is. A little tree there. That's a cool little detail. Man, they put in quite a few little details in here. I wasn't expecting. It's awesome. Please be in one piece. Oh my goodness, that's awesome. All hand painted. So the way he did this was uh, he, he carved out this bear. And then he went ahead and did a raz resin, resin casting of it. So it gets, picks up all the qualities of the original carving. And then he hand painted every last one of these bears. And they look amazing. It's pretty, pretty heavy too. It's got his uh, signature down there. He signed it in his little wood shop logo there on the bottom and printed on the bottom and uh, it's got an awesome little base here 
So look at those little teeth in there. Those aren't carved. That's painted in there. That is super cool. And I love how he made it. So he, it kind of looks like a kind of a stained version. So you kind of still feels just like a like a wood carving. So you kind of stay true to the original, you know, medium, which is really neat. So here he is standing up. He's about, let's see, nine and a half inches tall. It's a good size. He, uh, so let's try to put his hat on now, now that we have his little hat. So I just noticed here, not sure if you can see this, but it's got these little indentations here so that you can have it fit right on his ears and on his head. I didn't notice that until now, so now I know where the front is. So I'll line that up right here. You can kind of feel it pop on. And there it goes. Sits quite nicely. I could probably lay this in the back. There you go. <laughs> That's too awesome. I love that it's tilted forward on his head. But yeah, it'll sit right there real nicely. And I think you can also put that on the back so you can just kind of hang it behind him, which is pretty cool. I'm gonna try to put on the, try to put on this bandana. Okay, this is gonna be tricky. There we go. Got his little bandana. Now his little hat. Thanks so much for watching. I know I don't typically do these, but if you really do like these types of unboxing videos here and there, I won't do them all the time, but when I purchase some awesome art like Emmett here, uh, I will surely do it if you guys want to see some more of that. Uh, thank you guys so much. Like, subscribe, and uh, we'll see you next time.